What's up guys? So today I actually want to update my Green Ranger shelf. The last video I had actually had anything Tommy Oliver in it. Especially like the the White Ranger was involved and but I want to strictly make a Green Ranger shelf. So I kind of got to work on that while I'm revamping my room. But anyways, the picture in front of us right now I actually ordered online. So I don't know if it's legit or not. It did cost a little bit of money, but it came in this cool little like plastic thing but it came chipped too but the picture believe it or not it's not damaged so i don't know if this is a legit autograph or not but that's not important right now it just looks cool it's got a good background filler over here though that one is pride and joy that one has a big story to it uh that was nashville tennessee a couple years ago a couple summers ago uh jason david frank was in town and of course i spent like a lot of time and money and that's where that came from so that is badass i love it but my favorite hero in the world pretty much is the green ranger of course you got his dagger here which i do have a video on that where i play all the cool toys and the sounds so i like it and then of course the little stand which you can find on sds.com or whatever it's called but they also have a better version of this where it's green so not bad so the next thing i want to put up here is the black and gold Dragon Zord. I love this guy to death. He is just cool. I like the green and black one. Or what is it? Green and silver. But this one is just cool. Black and gold. So I don't know if he lights up and stuff or whatever. I never actually took him apart. I just took him out of the box and displayed him. But he is cool. I will do a video on him eventually. But he's cool to have, period. You have to have one. He's he's probably up there in the like 70 buck range. So now he's probably a lot more than that because I have, I had him for years. So next, this guy I picked up from I believe a Walmart or something. They were on sale, but he stayed in that case. Period. Should have done a little homework and find out what year that is, but that's just cool to have. So, I like my Green Ranger. This, this one, I picked up at Rick's Comics. Actually, yeah, for 20 bucks. I saw it, had to get it. It has the Sword of Darkness in there, two different hands. But he came out, I got him, I think, at the beginning of fall. But, he's amazing. Yeah, that's just, yeah, that's just cool. But he's going to be my next autograph figurine. If I ever get to meet the legend again so but he's he's awesome he is awesome this guy there is a red ranger also of this which looks cool but I cannot find it to save my life but he is actually a I think let's see well there's a little information about him but I got him, yeah, back in 2014 or 2015. But he's actually my first statue of the Green Ranger. Beautiful. Very beautiful. Next, I want to bring out, I got this little, it's actually created by, I, I want to say like a Japanese or Chinese version, but to me it's like a little pop or something. But there is different versions of him. Not different versions of him, but there's other characters to the collection. I only got the Green Ranger. Because I'm not really into these smaller figures, but I had to get him. He's just really, really sweet. So, so move the dagger over here a little bit. I'll put him, I guess, here. He's a good little... No, oh, he's staying in a box. Man, his glare's not working with me too well. Apologize about that, but he's a cool little dude. He is not a pop, but he has that almost a pop look. So that's what we got so far. Next is actually a new one, which I did the White Ranger, Red Ranger, and the Green Ranger. This is the PCS collectible. He was awesome. I had to get him right away as soon as he came out. He is gorgeous. Like I said, the only thing with him is you got to be careful because his flute will come out. 
so you have to be careful with that. But he is just awesome. I had to get him. He is he's a big filler. He just looks cool over there. Boom. Look at that. Move this guy over a little bit. Look at that. Let's see what else I got. Then I got these guys. They're actually made by Funko. The little Dragazord. Let's see. Well, you can't really tell, but 2000, yeah, 2017 Funko LLC. Yep, Funko. Well, he made the Green Ranger and the Dragon Zord, or they did. That is, they're nice. I like them. They're simple. I guess I don't really collect pops, but I don't really consider these pops. They're like little collectibles that came in a long box. Of course, I opened it because they were just really cool, and you can put them well wherever. And they'll fill in gaps and stuff. Like, I'll put him up here. Boom, look at that. Put the Green Ranger guy over here. But I'm strictly, like I said, making this a Green Ranger only shelf. So far, it's looking good. And there's a few more Green Rangers out there that I can get, but I'm tired. I don't want to get doubles of anything. I want to keep it simple and have one of each if possible. So that's why I'm doing it like this. But then, of course, you got this guy. I don't remember where I got him from. I got him online somewhere. But he does come with this little stand right here. You can actually take off. But it helps him maintain his balance and stuff. So his weapon does not come out. He is not posable. But he is just, he's just cool to look at. Hold that guy right there. And, of course, my classic little guy. I've always had one of these. I don't, maybe middle school or something like that but I always lose them or a dog chewed one up but got another one and he's staying with me so and I do have pretty much the whole set of the Rangers the villains I do not have but he's just cool hmm I guess right there put him over here but that right now is my Green Ranger set Tommy Oliver Jason David Frank the first appearance of him ever being a Power Ranger. And I love this. It is simple, it's beautiful, and it's green. I like that green. But he does have a sort of darkness I like to get, and I actually might have find a way to mount it actually on that wall. So I have to might have to modify pictures. There is maybe a couple other collectibles, like I said, I might try to pick up. But these guys are harder to find. His um his big helmet you can actually wear now I try pricing that I think it was like three hundred dollars so maybe but it's a Green Ranger thing so I might actually have to get it but I don't think it'll fit on this shelf so I will have to modify this again but I hope you guys enjoyed this it's just do I'm slowly revamping stuff cleaning the shelves off a little bit and making it more space here more room here and I'm adding more like I said furniture and stuff and trying to build rebuild some stuff so but the Green Ranger was the first one, so I did that today, and, well, hope you guys enjoyed it. And one more pass. If there's anything in here you like, your favorite or something, please let me know. Because the Green Ranger is cool, and the word Dragon Zord just sounds cool. So, well, hope you guys enjoyed this. Go Green Ranger. Till next time, kitties.